How's it going everyone? My name is Bradley and welcome to a short visual novel game called Adolescent Santa Claus and this time we got a guest that we haven't had for quite some time and I'm very glad to have her back. Welcome back, Akari. Hello! Yes, our beloved kitty friend is back, so... This story is about... Warrior. Cute. This story is about <laughs> some random guy who is alone on Christmas Eve when a little girl strangely decides to visit him. No, that came out wrong. When a strange little girl decides to visit him, claiming that she's Santa Claus. So, let's see what the story's about. When it first like an odd story. When I first opened the game, there was a Japanese voice, but we decided that... I decided that I'd bring Hikari along for the ride. Since you know there's captions and all that. Christmas Eve. I was in my room, staring off into the distance. The room was as plain as it gets. No noise, no color, not even a smell. What's the big deal about Christmas anyways? Everything is so stagnant. Nothing ever changes around here. <sighs> I let out a deep and drawn out sigh. Now that I think about it, there was once a more innocent time when I used to believe in Santa Claus. Santa. Will he ever come? He probably won't. I'm no longer a kid, after all. Phew. After laying out a sigh, I rolled over. Once I did so, there was... Cute little girl. Me a gift. There was a kid version Santa Claus. <laughs> she suddenly popped out demanding a gift from me that made me flinch a bit. No, hang on. Where is she even coming from? She wasn't here a second ago. I don't know. Let's not think about it. Sorry, I don't have anything for you. I had absolutely no idea where she came in from, but she seemed rather harmless and cute. I have nothing left? Is there no way to turn off the sound? I've got no money. Anything else? Well, I can't give you my computer, I can't give you my clothes, and I can't give you my books. They're my bare necessities, after all. Oh, don't you have something else to offer? Like what? Oops, and dreams. I've got none of those either. I figured. Sorry, you might want to try somebody better off. Mm. Mm. She said, leering at me. Won't leave until you give me a gift. Whatever, do what you want. Am I hallucinating? Or am I dreaming? The kid Santa laid out a joyous chuckle while she ran <laughs> around me in a circle. Today is Christmas Eve. I couldn't even tell what's real or not anymore. To be honest, it didn't really matter. All that was clear was that this cute kid Santa Claus wasn't going to leave me alone. Cute lowly. <laughs> Twelve twenty-four, Christmas Eve. I locked my door, and doing that made it seem like I'd sealed myself into my very own private world. A tranquil one that I won't be disturbed in. All I needed to do was to close the door out of the lack of miracles, expecting nothing. The only thing I need in my world is me. All I need is a world with a population of one. Me. But... Santa was still tirelessly orbiting around me. Just running around endlessly. She's starting to get on my nerves. Sit. She sat. For some reason, it feels like she'd give me her hand if I say paw to her. <laughs> Let's not do that. <laughs> yeah, good choice. So, who exactly are you? Santa. Santa Claus. You're wearing a school uniform. Kuredo Santa ya. Well, Santa Claus. I guess she's right. 
After all, I didn't realize that she was Santa right after seeing her. Of course, because the usual Santa doesn't look anything like a cute girl. Definitely didn't suspect <laughs> that. How was I able to do that? Hmm, I'm not sure. But there are those times in life that you just want to forget about it and all, forget about it all and do as your heart desires, right? It was one of those days. Christmas Eve. The one time in a year where everyone just wants to forget about reality and live in their dreams. Weren't Santa's extinct? Managed to survive by wearing a school uniform. So that's how Santa started wearing a school uniform. Because nobody will suspect <laughs> someone in a school uniform. How does it feel to be a cute girl? Costume play? It's like cosplay. I agree. Santa's depraved. No, I'm still Santa in heart. Even if I wear a school uniform. Then why are you taking the presents away? I thought Santa was supposed to be giving them. Withdrawing. Withdrawing? I'm taking back the things I gave away when everyone was little. I was about to say we're not ATMs, but yeah. Why? Because I loaned it to you. Loaned what? No. Hopes, dreams, future? That sort of stuff. I'm assuming you said that, but you cut out. <laughs> Wait, you were lending those? Hmm. Yeah, I was gonna take everything back with interest, but. But. Everyone went bankrupt. <laughs> Santa was actually a loan shark. We were all being deceived. The bastard! So basically, you're here to repossess the hopes and dreams you gave to me when I was younger? Yep, and I'm gonna take them back with interest to the very last penny. Eh, you don't want to know what goes on in my mind nowadays. <laughs> anyway, sorry, I'm broke as well. <laughs> Santa twitched as if she had taken a hit to her emotions. Twitch, twitch. That was kind of cute. Kianiso. There's a deadline. A deadline? 24th and the 25th. So today and tomorrow. I missed the deadline, I would have to return this uniform to its owner. And then. Santa will go extinct! Well, because Santa can only escape the danger of going extinct by wearing a school uniform and becoming a beautiful girl. Because that makes total sense. Hmm. That's not very... It is very easy to understand. It's just common anime logic. Therefore... Santa looked as though she was planning to explain it to me. Once the 25th passes, anything I do will be pointless. Why? Because today and tomorrow are meant to be the most fantastic days of all. Fantastic. 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 Ah, fantastic. Yeah, fantastic, fantastic day. So, Santa has to collect her payment in full within the next two days. Huh. It's urgent! Fantastic. Sorry, I literally have nothing. It's... 
you say something? The noise. Oh. It's morning. The sun is rising. Even on the most fantastic of all days, like the sun rises like any other. Sun, 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 sunny day. Christmas Eve is a sunny day. Ah, that's not fantastic at all. I'm guessing the sun is not too fond of the snow from the way he killed them all. It heated and melted them away. Poor snow. Sun tends to always be like that. Sunny places are always like that. Reality is always like that. Santa. What? Eh? Eh? Where's Rudolph? I grilled and ate him. Well, that escalated quickly. <laughs> Why would you ask that? Did it taste good? <laughs> oh dear god. This is hilarious, but also very, very sad and savage. Holy shit. Tears? Santa는 배가 고파서 루돌프를 구워 먹었어. Santa는 사랑하는 루돌프를 먹지 않으면 안될 정도로 굶주렸었거든. Santa was hungry, so she had to eat Rudolph. Santa was starving to the point where if she didn't eat her beloved Rudolph, she would have perished. <laughs> you said that last line so casually, though. How did it get to this? Well, since all the kids who received my loan went bankrupt, I'm also broke. <sighs> hmm. Oh, that excitement may be a bit tired, but I can still go. Rudolph. Rudolph. Rudolph is inside me now. Did you repeat that? Sorry. Did you repeat that? Fine. Rudolph is inside me now. We'll be together forever. How is Santa meant to get around without Rudolph? What else? Santa walks. You walk? No, Rudolph was able to fly. But just because I ate him doesn't mean I can fly now. Nose red. We decide to have a moment of silence for Rudolph. Rest in peace, Rudolph. You went out in the worst possible way ever. What do you plan to do once the 24th and 25th is over? 363일 동안 꿈과 희망을 만들어. I'm going to go make more hopes and dreams for the next 363 days. And with those... And with those... With those, I'm going to distribute them all on the 24th and 25th. Santa is great. I see. Santa is great. I'm not at hard times with the factory, though. So the factory is now a pile of debris. This took a real turn for the worst. Why? Because the children who borrowed the hopes and dreams from us all filed for bankruptcy altogether. Sorry, but I don't have anything. <laughs> the 
morning went by and it is now noon. Afternoon. Ah, uh, afternoon. Do they seriously just have multiple lines of repeating the same words over and over? I want to see snow. White snow. A white paranormal landscape. I want to see a beautiful white scenery. Go away, son. Let the snow fall. Pa. I'm hungry. Santa was starving. You're hungry? Rudolph is crying out that he's hungry from inside of me. Rudolph. You're alive? I have ramen if you want. Instant food is bad. I don't like instant food. <coughs> Excuse me. <sighs> we could always starve. <laughs> the creditor forced violence on the debitor. A knuckle to my forehead. Ow! One minute of recovery. Healed. I passed out. Meh. One minute passed. Regret. Pioneer. That's a relief. Hey, I wouldn't die from that. Possible things could also happen on this fantastic day. Fantastic day. I can't afford to be careless on this fantastic day. Santa. What? Eh? Why did you start leading hopes and dreams to kids? Well, I was selling them at first. You were selling them? Hmm. Mm hmm? For how much? Spare. Just spare? I saw your despair to us. We'll give you hope. Take all my despair! No, wait. How does that work as a business? Don't know why or how, but it sure was popular. And then. At some point, humans stopped selling it to us. Said they couldn't give it to us even if they wanted to. What do you mean? Hold on to it like a treasure, but scream for help to separate it from them. That sounds about right. Uh. That's why we started loaning the hopes and dreams to them. Stop yawning, damn you. Why did you lend it to them when you could just as easily have given them away? Tend to be thrown away if we give it to them for free. Oh. Threw it away! Hey, too, your debitor! Ow! I was hit on the forehead by a fist. For a playful gist, it was unexpectedly strong that I nearly fell over. Anyway, so since you, they were throwing them away, if you just give it to them, you started loaning them out instead? Mm. I plan to have them return to the lot of interest. Mm -hmm. But everyone went bankrupt. Oh. Give it back! Give it back! Sorry, I got nothing. <laughs> Is there not an option I can do here? It was now late in the afternoon and the sun had returned home. I gave Santa a cup of water. How is it? Rudolph doesn't like it. Do you honestly think I can satisfy my hunger with just minerals? He says. Oh, Rudolph. 
love. You don't plan on being picky with what you eat in your current status, are you? Santa. What? Huh? What do you plan to do from now on, Santa? Since this whole thing is about leaning isn't working out, shouldn't you try something else? Mm. <laughs> Can you try and come up with a plan? We decide to contemplate for a moment. I don't know. Just when I thought this loan shark idea was good and original when I came up with it. You sure you weren't just being greedy? You know, with the interest in that's all and the soul of it. I swear 10 years ago you definitely think he promised that you would even pay it back by a hundred times, no a thousand times. We even went as far as spit shaking on it. This Santa. No matter how I look at it, there's no denying that she has a deeply rooted sense of resentment. Get it back! Get it back! You promised to give it back at a hundred thousand times its original worth, didn't you? Sorry, I lost it all, so I have nothing left. <laughs> you could almost visually see Santa's heart sinking. <laughs> Seriously, what am I supposed to do now? For the first time, Santa is showing some true sense of anxiety. Santa, we've wasted a day. Christmas Eve is almost over. <laughs> oh, there we go. It's gone. It's Christmas Day now. <laughs> Christmas Day arrived without a slightest show of mercy. Looking outside of the window, I could see the snow dancing in the wind. Yay, it's snowing. It was uh, quite here like it. <laughs> Sorry about my yawning. I wonder if I could see a... I wonder if I could see a sea of white when I open my eyes tomorrow. Santa, do you want to stay up all night? No. I want to go to uh, kids need to sleep early. I'm an adult now. Anya, they got you booty quit, Jiman, Bauman, and Santa in Gotarum. Those who caught through an old Nijiman, Bauman, and Orinia. Just like how my mind is still Santa, even though I'm wearing a school uniform. Your mind is still that of a child, even though you appear like an adult on the outside. You know me too well. Mind? We are not too much, Anna. Too young and Baum. Appearances don't really matter. What's important is the way you feel in your heart. My heart is always Santa. Let me see me say goodnight. Santa pulled the blanket over herself and laid down the bed. I followed suit and pulled the blanket over myself and laid down too. For some reason, we ended up using the same single blanket. Sweet dreams, Santa. Honey dream, Sonia. Dreams, get up. Twelve twenty-five, Christmas. Christmas Day. Although the outside world Although the outside world was brilliant and spotless, the spiteful sun in the sky had the every intent of obliterating anything. The sun was killing the snow, 
Fractal by fractal. Santa. What? Hmm? Can you just ask the sun to leave us alone for a bit? After all, it's meant to be a fantastic day, alright? I'm asking it nicely. Hey, son, scram! He said oh. nicely. I was ignored. Reality <laughs> is always like that. Sob, sob. I love this visual now. <laughs> this is hilarious. I do feel bad for the kid though, not being able to collect the dreams and then suddenly becoming non-existent. Santa has made a ball, a snowball, and started rolling it in the snow. What are you doing, Santa? <laughs> Making a snowman. <laughs> I also start to roll the snowball. Roll, roll. Round, round. Round, round. Round, 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 round. I finished making the small ball. Santa has finished making the body portion of the snowman. I'll put the small ball on top of that. Snowman was now complete. No, it isn't. It's missing a carrot nose. Now what? If we just leave it here, the sun's gonna come and kill it. Oh, yeah, I know, right? It's like a mayfly. Slowly but painfully. A mayfly? What's a mayfly? I don't know. <laughs> I'll just put up a picture of one right here. It's like with the fate of only living a day in its lifetime. Snowman is gonna melt by tomorrow. Happy when it's there. But once it's gone, you'll forget about it. It in the first place. Hmm. I know what that's like. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> really? Really, what? Should I do? Sorry, I keep cutting out every now and then. Santa gave me a peek from the corner of her eye. 14 hours of Christmas left. Only 14 hours of the fantastic day left. Only 14 we get it. Once the day is over, it will all melt and die. We have to find a way to keep it before that happens. Should we put it in the fridge? It won't grow. It'll only going to get hard and stiff. Isn't that the point? What exactly should we do? <laughs> Santa looked depressed. Is there really nothing else we can do now? Santa looked at me. I tried giving them out for free. I tried by letting them out. Being Santa's a tough job. I don't see any light. Last one, you know. Santa's died out. I'm the last one standing. Who's responsible for that? You debitor. Oh shit, that's right. The creditor swung violence at the debitor. <laughs> Ow! I received a precise blow to the center of my chin. Oh, that's gonna hurt my bottom jaw. Ow. That really hurts. 
15 is a cheap price to pay. Ugh. I thought about it for an hour. Oh, I thought about it for an hour. And it was just rolling snowballs for the past hour. Any good ideas? So, good ideas. Thing, but it's not the best of all ideas. Let me guess, you're gonna kill me. What is it? Don't we go on a strike and protest outside the city hall? That is a terrible idea. Don't. Well, giving out hopes and dreams is labor too, you know. No one is going to take you seriously. <sighs> it was late in the evening. We returned home. Santa, it's dinner time. <laughs> but why does it have to be a school uniform? Couldn't you have gone for anything else? Santa who wears a school uniform is forever in their teens. Teens? You look younger than that. Though my heart is Santa, since I'm wearing a school uniform, my appearance is also forced to be that of a teen. I guess that's fair. Hey, you should wear one too! Blah? Hm. Once I came to, I was wearing a school uniform. I wish I had one, but it's either gone or it doesn't fit anymore. This is weird. It feels like I've reverted back to being a high school student again. Mm, it looks good! It looks good on you! Santa looked pleased. Santa no longer has any powers, so all she can do are small things. Since they made it for you, you have to pay it back to me by a thousand fold next year. What did you make? And dreams. What? When? Kubu. School uniform. Eh? This school uniform is hopes and dreams? Well, it was always inside you, so all I did was pull it out. All you need to do is make it bigger. But it feels like it's going to melt and die by tomorrow. <sighs> Santa. I'm sorry. You're sorry, then pay me back, you debitor. The creditor. Didn't swing violence at the debtor? Santa looked at me blankly. It's not time. What? It's only an hour left. Huh? So there's only one hour left of Christmas. It's impossible to obtain the hopes and dreams of an hour, isn't it? <laughs> Santa, I have a request. Is it debitor? Come back next year. Yeah. Yeah. Next year. You gonna be okay with that? Honestly, not really. <laughs> I'll give it my best shot though in gathering the hopes and dreams, but the sun's too strong. It might be gone by tomorrow. Even if that does happen, I'll still wait patiently for the fantastic day. Until the day I can borrow hope from you again. 
Demeter, do you even know how much debt you earn right now? Pretty much to the point where my life is fucked. But how much? <clears throat> Gave you the loan back when you were seven, so you have 13 years worth of interest to pay back. Oh shit. <laughs> What do I have to pay it back? Hopes and dreams to 13 other people. Wait, you're telling me this was pyramid selling all along? Santa has to put bread on the table, too. Cruel Santa. So basically, to pay her back, I have to pay 13 times the initial amount. Alright, I'll come again next year. If you haven't given hopes and dreams to 13 people by then, increase it by tenfold. 130 people? If you aren't able to reach the quota by the year after that, then I'll raise it to... 1300 people. Wow, you're like a dictionary definition of a loan shark. <laughs> <laughs> the corrupt lender smiled. Okay. Yeah. South and North Pole won't melt. 처음엔 녹아도 녹지 않을 정도로 많아지고 단단해지면 돼. Even if it starts to melt, you just have to make it bigger and stronger until it gets to the point where it can't melt. Put it in the fridge? <laughs> <laughs> There's something called a freezer, you know. It'll only become firm, but not strong, but not bigger. Ugh. hard! <laughs> yep, you just said that. Sun kills it again. I'll grant you a loan on the next fantastic day. Then you'll increase the quota by ten times. Kurachi. Of course. Wow. And I'm guessing that this is going to keep going down the tiers of your pyramid scheme. Kure. Ah, try raising the numbers up to somewhere in the million. Impossible? That's just impossible. Fine. The pyramid makes it possible. There's only like 7 million people in the world as far as I know. <laughs> the short Christmas is now coming to an end. You're really going to come next year, right? Mm. <laughs> I'm not sure what's going to ha happen to me by then. Neither. Even so. Even so? Oh, wait. I'm not going to make a promise when I have a feeling that you may break it. This debitor? Christmas is coming to an end. You aren't going? Majimaguru, Hamadi. One last thing to say. Hmm. What is it? Kumawa. Thank you. Hmm. Why? Majimagiosto. For the last one. Last what? Majimag. Kogigiosto. Dika. You are my last customer. Ah. That's a relief. I didn't lose my job. For some reason, the sight of Santa smiling felt faint. I'm going to make 130 hopes and dreams by next year. So. Yeah. Next year, I'll make 130 I'll bring 130 next year. By then, I might be able to get some help. Hmm. 
다음 해인 1300개 그 다음 해인 13000개 그 다음 해인 1300개 그 다음 해인 1300개 그 다음 해인 1300개 And the after that, how's it? 130,000. Wow. If it grows that big, I'll be able to run my factory again. Santa. Oh. Hmm? What's your dream? 사람들에게. People, hopes, and dreams. I see. 그렇지. Work hard. 나도. How could you say no to that smile? <laughs> the clock hit 12 and Christmas Day was over. December 26th. The fantastic day was over. Though my heart still felt finessed fantastic. Yes, there is a risk that the sun may kill the fantastic feeling once I open this door and step outside. Even so. Even so, even so, let's open the door. If you put it in the fridge, then it'll only become firm, but it will never grow. Let's hang it in there for a year. Let's hang in there while I give people hopes and dreams. I'm looking forward to Christmas next year. Goodbye, Santa. I will wait. Oh my god. <laughs> that was a beautiful and hilarious story. I enjoyed every minute of that. <laughs> Did you enjoy Hikari? That was fun and definitely strange. Yeah, that was pretty strange. Especially since we were dealing with a teenage girl who ate Rudolph. That that was <laughs> totally unexpected, but I gotta say my very part was probably telling the sun to scream, even though that's not going to happen. <laughs> I've seen funny stuff like that on the internet before, but this is another hilarious visual novel, and I enjoyed every minute of it, just like I did with Trick and Treat. So, and uh, I apologize for my yawning. I was seriously interested in this story. Otherwise, I would have probably stopped playing it. And sorry for Hikari's mic cutting out, but, you know, the words were there, so... Should have been able to read along, no problem. But that's okay, a that kid is terrible. Yep, the internet is pretty shitty, even though it's 2018. By 2019, hopefully technology can get their shit together. But for now, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the story. I sure as hell did. This was amazing, and I'm really glad I finally got around to playing it. So, thank you guys for watching. Please leave a like, subscribe to my awesome channel. I'm not sure if I'll we'll have Hikari back and more stuff, but we'll see what happens in the future. And we will see you guys next time. Later, everyone. Bye.